Hi and welcome to the session. Today's topic is from solution to equation. Using the technique of doing same mathematical operation on both the sides, we can get an equation from a solution. For example, let us take y equal to 2. Now, let us multiply both sides by 3. So, this will give us 3y is equal to 2 into 3 that is 6. So, here this is an equation for the solution y is equal to 2. Thus, we have formed an equation for the given solution. Now, if we are given one equation, then we can find only one solution for that equation. But, if we are given a solution, then we can find many equations for the given solution. Let's see how. We have reached to the equation 3y is equal to 6. Now, let us add 5 on both the sides. So, we will get 3y plus 5 is equal to 6 plus 5. That is, 3y plus 5 is equal to 11. So, here, this is the second equation for the given solution. That is, y is equal to 2. Now, if we multiply or divide both the sides of the given solution by some other number, then we will get some other equation. Similarly, if we add or subtract some other number on both the sides, then we will get some other equations for the given solution. Thus, we can form many more equations for the given solution y is equal to 2. Now, let's move on to applications of simple equations to practical situations. We come across many situations or statements in everyday life which can be solved using simple equations. First, we convert the situation or statement in simple equation and then we solve that simple equation to give the solution to the problem. For example, if we are given that in a triangle ABC, angle A is to angle B is to angle C is equal to 3 is to 2 is to 1, that means the ratio of the measures of angle A is to angle B is to angle C is equal to 3 is to 2 is to 1 and we need to find the measure of all the three angles. Now, first of all, we will change the given problem to a simple equation. Let's see how we do that. Suppose we have a triangle ABC. Then, let us assume that angle A is equal to 3x. Angle B is equal to 2x and angle C is equal to 1x as the ratio of angle A is to angle B is to angle C is equal to 3 is to 2 is to 1. Now, we know that sum of three angles of a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. That means here angle A plus angle B plus angle C will be equal to 180 degrees. That is 3x plus 2x plus 1x will be equal to 180 degrees. This implies 6x will be equal to 180 degrees. That means x will be equal to 180 degrees upon 6. That will be 30 degrees. Now we got the value of x. So, here angle A will be equal to 3 into 30 degrees, that is 90 degrees. Angle B will be equal to 2 into 30 degrees, that is 60 degrees. And angle C will be equal to 1 into 30 degrees, that is 30 degrees. Thus, we got the measures of all the three angles. Thus, in this session we have learned how to form equations from the given solution and applications of simple equations to practical situations. With this, we finish this session. Hope you must have understood all the concepts. Goodbye, take care and have a nice day.